What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ocarina of Time. Where's Link? Where is it? Oh, oh, is that a little green cap I see? Is that a little fairy I see? Let's talk to this stupid woman. This is a Gerudo Street yeah, yeah. Wait a minute. Is it gonna stir me over? I think it's gonna like stir me over. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, that would have sucked. That would have really sucked. Okay, so I don't really remember how far I got. I'm so happy. That would have sucked so badly if it started me over. Do I have all the skull chills in here? Oh, there's no map for here, is there? Interesting. Is there any, any skull chills in here? Maybe not. All I remember is I believe we were on the left path. And then we came to a silver block. A silver block! Aw oh, man, I don't want to do this crap again. Eh. It sucks that there's no freaking map in this place. Ah! <laughs> Probably should remember that. I thought this fire barrier thing was on the first floor. Oh, it hit me again, apparently. I didn't take damage that time, though. There we go, it's right here. Yeah, yeah, without the necessary items. I gotcha. And there's nothing behind here? Yeah, I totally know it was a fake door. I remember. Yeah, what up? What up? Do I have do I have the lens of truth, though? That is another question. Is that is another question? I wonder if anybody, like, as a kid... Ooh, interesting. I never saw that before. I wonder if anyone as a kid actually came here and, um... Uh, completed the Shadow Temple without the Lens of Truth. Like, without a guide and all that. So, I mean, I guess it's possible. Could I have just gone this way this entire freaking time? Wait, where did that go? Wait, what? That was weird. Okay, well, I guess we're going this way now. <laughs> oh, and that leads up here, I see. Okay, well, I guess we're not even going the way that, you know, we got the... Can I use a scare scroll song to get up here? Man, this game sometimes... Ooh, girl! I don't know, looks like there's a chest we never would've gotten otherwise. We got the key! Can we use the key yet? Well, I guess we have, but we never, um... You know, did the thing. Yeah. Did the thing. Um, you, like went to the, the where all the locked doors are. I'm trying to insinuate here, but it wasn't really coming out properly. So I was like, "You guys know what I'm talking about," but you know, maybe you didn't. So I figured I would, you know, clarify. And, and this is way too long-winded of a thing. One with silver hand shall move a giant block. That was definitely not Navi. That is not a, how Navi structures her sentences. Alright, so here's the freaking cursed block that I had no idea you had to freaking have the gloves for, stupid game. No, we probably, actually, I can almost guarantee you, we could have completed this place um, with only. Holy crap, that's a lot of like likes. Like, I can't even, like, believe it, like. Did I just lose rupees? I swear I just saw my rupee number go out. But maybe I'm a cray cray. In fact, I can almost guarantee you that I am a cray cray. <laughs> Oh, okay then. That's great. Thank you, game. Thank you. I really need that bull crap right now. You steal anything? No. It's because you're a stupid butt. Why can't I attack you? Hello? Are these beatable blake lights? What is this crap? Why is it taking so little health from me? This is pathetic. <laughs> Are you dead yet? Are you dead yet? Maybe I was just hitting some weird invisible wall. Yeah, I don't know why I wanted the rupee so bad. See, why can't I hit you? There we go. No, I totally thought I could kill it in time. I gotta remember not using the big Goron sword anymore, though. You know what? I'm gonna stop using the big Goron sword for the rest of the game. I think we've used it enough. We've seen all the damage it could do. And it does make this game a little too easy, in my opinion, so. Oh, nice. You do get a thing from killing all the bad guys. Although we did see another room, like just getting that key right now, we saw a room we had not been in yet. See, this wouldn't be too bad. Ooh, who droopy? Nice. This wouldn't be too. Oh, there's another chest. What the heck? I don't even. Is there another one? Is that a third one? I mean, there's one up there, but you know, is there one in each of these holes? All right, got that one. Oh, there's not one there, unless unless it's invisible. It is. I freaking knew it. Man, I feel like I should have my lens of truth on for this entire temple at this point. Uh, I mean, it's awesome for another one to be hidden. Oh, wow, really, game? Really? You won't play that way? Stupid. Stupid! Uh, nothing up. 
that freaking Trixky game and the Trixky Hobbits is. Okay, so yeah, um, I guess we really don't have anything left to do in this game, like, after beating this. Is that? Oh, that is right above there. It's kind of funny. Kind of hilarious. You know, so very funny. Ha ha, no, hee hee. <laughs> I totally almost fell for that again. <laughs> ah, that would have been stupid. Dude, that fire always kicks my butt. Each and every single time that I try to sing a rhyme. There's this stupid asshole spike track. Trap. Spike track. The track that's also a spike. Alright, now the only place we haven't gone yet. If you can overcome the trap. Oh, yes. I don't know why that popped up coming through that door. That's kind of weird. Could summon a big fairy, but nah. Let's go through the middle door now. Oh, that just leads here. I'm missing a key. Well, I mean, I guess we could just start going through. I remember we go left. I mean, we've gone through all the rooms, right? Maybe that chest was actually empty. Am I crazy? That chest was probably empty. Because I just went every way I could, right? I don't know. Are you going to give me a key for some reason? I don't know. You're going to give me a puppa will pay. A puppa will pay. A puppy la pew. Yay, once again, I do not know if there's actually a way to screw yourself over. I kind of feel like there would be. Because like, there's a lot more doors in here than, like, the seven I have keys for, right? Maybe not. Yeah. Yay, it's a red rupee. I'm, like, kind of hoping that maybe I'm going to get keys from these. Can I climb up at any point and be like, hey, just dropping in. Ha <laughs> ha. Wait. Okay, I thought the door was locked for a second. But the last it is not. Ah, oh, see, there's a chest right here. Is there a chest there as well? No, there's not. Is there two locked doors here? Do I get another option of which way to go again? I got a bunch of fair rolls. All covered in cheese. I don't know what that means. Okay, no, this is the only locked door to go through. So far, so great. Two. Is that it? Have I completed it? Welp. We have completed the dungeon, guys. And I'm not even kidding. I actually have. Okay, is it the wrong way? Is, it, is this chest locked as well? No. <laughs> and... And... We got the ice arrows set to see and your arrows will be fired up. If you hit your target, it will freeze. This arrow magic is granted only to those who complete the different training of the Gerudos so use it with pride. Oh, I will, Navit. Oh, I will. Is that the only way to get in here? Yes, it is. Hmm. Alright, now I have to annoyingly go back through here. What would happen if I went right? Maybe I get another key or something. Uh, see, that's what I mean, though. It's like, there's more... I feel like there's more locked doors in here than there are keys for me to get. So, is there a way to screw myself out of ever getting the ice arrows? Maybe if you use up all your keys, maybe that's where the one try pretend rupees things come in, comes in handy. Maybe the key I saw... Like from the other, or the chest, the chest that I didn't think I saw was from one of, the, or was me looking in this room somehow. When I move that silver block, I mean, I'm just trying, to, I'm just trying to really justify not going back to this place because I don't really care and I've collected everything I need. Yeah, see what I mean? Huh. Oh, see, I've gotten that chest before. Hmm. I mean, we've clearly been there before, right? Yeah. See, that's what I mean. I feel like we could have screwed ourselves out of every game that because, I mean, we would have gone through this entire... Well, there is a... There has to be another key, then. That's the only solution, because it looks like there's only one more key in this place. Should I go look for it, or should I say screw it? I mean... I think I'm going to not look for it. I mean, is there really a point? I don't think so. I mean, we got what we came here for, and we could have gotten what we came here for to begin with, but I want to kind of legitimately go through all the rooms, and I did that. Do you say anything now about ice arrows? This is Judo's training. Oh, wow. Don't even acknowledge the fact. You know what? You know what? Can't believe I'm doing this. I'm going to murder her. <sighs> so I've never even tried out ice arrows. Oh, it looks so cool. It's so rare that you see this. That looks really free. It doesn't look like ice. I'll tell you that right now. It does look like you're casting a spell. I guess it's supposed to look like snow or something. It doesn't like, you know, create... Oh, that is really cool. Alright. 
So, I completed what I came here to do. That means there's only one more temple left to do. Um, I guess we could spend the rest of this episode. Well... Uh... Let's go to Zora's Domain. And see if we can find the sculpture there. Or not Zora's Domain, sorry. Um, Lake Hylia. Where should we go to Zora's Domain? Well, let's go to Lake Hylia. Wait, why did I go to the map for? I was like, I'll just teleport there using a warp point that I don't have. Recreate the spirit. You know, I totally wish when we got all the heart pieces in the game, this thing stayed full. That would be cool, and it would justify or not. It would make me make my OCD happy. <laughs> a down, right, right, left. A down. No. A down, left, left. No. A down, right, right, left. Oh, there we go. Yay, dyslexia. Um, I don't actually have OCD. I feel the need to say that, like whenever I say something like, it makes my OCD happy because I really don't have it. I just have OCD-like tendencies, as my psychology teacher once said. Okay. Now, where the heck? Well, first off, I, I too, totally want to try... What's that do? Oh, okay, maybe we shouldn't shoot at all the registered. <laughs> Nothing, really? It doesn't freeze the water or anything? That's pretty lame. Is there any bad guys over here? No, of course there isn't. I totally feel like there should be a sculpture over there. You know what? One second, guys. I'm gonna look at my notes. Okay, everybody. I'm back. Um, apparently, there is a sculpture on top of here, if my thing is correct. I mean, my brain that I totally remember where every sculpture is. Even though I never played this game completely before. <laughs> apparently, there's a sculpture up here. Which is weird, because, I mean, you can't even hear it, but it totally makes sense. I mean, the fact that there is a branch up here, people should be interested. Oh, yeah, there totally is. Oh, man. <laughs> this is going to be a pain in the PP, isn't it? Uh, ooh, holy crap, that moon goes so quick. Stop it, moon. Stop it. Stop. Moon. I swear, moon. Okay, hello. Hello. I gotta just get it from this branch, probably. I'll kill you! i kill you and steal your soul! Yeah! Awesome opossum. Alright, now have we completed this area? This thing is the most helpful thing ever. Oh, we have not! Oh, uh, you know what that might mean? It might mean we actually... Uh, I think I know what that means. I'm pretty sure we have to come back here as a kid. So I'm pretty sure the sculpture I'm missing is over here. But I totally thought we had to get this as an adult, but it seems not to be the case. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. Well, Navi goes to two spots here. Yep. Yeah, doesn't look like it's here. And it's already morning time. Okay, the other sculpture is actually in Zora's Fountain. So I'm just gonna go over there. I guess there's no real quick way. Oh, you know what? There is kind of a quick way, I guess. Probably going to the forest temple, then walking the rest of the way and using the teleports and stuff. So, give me a second, guys. I'm just gonna teleport there, and I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, so I'm pretty sure the only other sculpture I'm missing after this, I actually have to be a child again, which is stupid, but, you know, we'll do that in the next episode, and then we'll be finishing the game, guys. It's gonna be crazy sauce. Crazy town sauce! Yeah! Let's go! Whoa. Is today going to be the day I finish this game? It might be, which is weird and scary to think about. I don't feel like this project... Well, it did last quite a while, to be honest. I, feel, I was going to say, I feel like this didn't last long at all, but I guess it kind of did, didn't it? <clears throat> Sidebars were different for me to edit. I mean, I've tried doing fancy smart stuff in the past, but this is probably the biggest endeavor I've ever done in a Let's Play. Um, the only thing that would probably be better... Dang it. <laughs> yeah, in my opinion, is if I had, um, well, first off, an intro would be really nice, but I'm not even going to mess with that. Any intro I wouldn't make for myself would just be straight up embarrassing. And second off, um, an end bar, like I used to have for like Skyward Sword and some other Let's Plays. But I kind of stopped doing it because I never update annotations ever. As much as I wish I could do that, I mean, the only, the only reason I can't is because everything I do... Wait, can I teleport up there? I mean, not teleport. Can I scarecrow something up there? I don't know where Navi is. Where'd Navi go? Well, anyways, not important. Wait. Oh, all those trees and bushes up there look actually really cool. 
How about they like go up the mountain? Like they did a lot of detail on that. They didn't have to put those there, but they did. That's nice for Nintendo, isn't it? Alright, so you guys remember long, long ago, we exploded this place. Oh, I just realized this place isn't even ice anymore. I guess there's still ice blocks, but I mean, wasn't this entire- Well, I guess it was never really ice, was it? Never mind, I thought this entire place was like iced over. Yeah, there's this block here that never exploded when we blew up the rest of this place, so if we pick it up, we'll go- oh, I toss you! Well, there's an entire hole? Really? No, get in- No, Link? Link! Link! Can I just back walk into it? Without no, just drop! Down! No! Drop! I see the thing that says down, I'm pressing A. It's not working. Oh. There we go. Holy crap. Oh, uh, see, there's a thing. Holy crap! Honestly, I just thought there was gonna just be a sculpture under here, but can I break this spot, please? Holy crap. <laughs> Come on, give me the magic. I don't need it, but I need to assert my victory. Oh, the sculptures apparently. Yeah. So many bad guys! Don't know why they're invisible. This ain't no shadow temple. I do not know where this leads either. Look, we're even off the map right now. Like on the bottom right, like the actual map. Uh, there's another one up here. You know what? You need to leave, sir. I guess maybe this is meant to be the last skull shell you get in the game. That's maybe why this is all like, not cinematic, but all different, like. Okay, so judging by the fact it's not here, it's totally gonna be night, doesn't it? Oops. Please don't tell me it teleports me to the back to the beginning of this area. That would suck. Oh, it totally does! I gotta do it again! Why?! Does this place change it? I- mm. Interesting, the rock respawn for some strange reason. <laughs> I like how Link like cracks his knuckles. As we go do this, okay, let's see if we do this first try. Yes, we did! Yes, we can! Uh, totally thought those pots were the sculpture for some reason. What? Just because we haven't successfully used the ice arrows yet. Let's grab those and also the lens of truth, just in case this asshole is invisible. Okay. Oh, that's right, we can't use two types of magic at once. Man, they're invisible, so we can't even see what happens. Yeah, assholes. Hey, you all. All y'all assholes need to die. <laughs> And Camo Kablamo. I mean, I haven't even heard of this sculpture yet, but it's here somewhere. I know it is. I mean, the spiders themselves are pretty formidable. Oh, you know what? There's a non invisible enemy up here. Or maybe even a visible one. I can't even take the lens of truth off while I'm climbing. Well, that's just great. Well, that's just super ain't it. Do 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 do. There we go. Alright. Bam! Seriously? Did it just disappear? That's lame. Welp. Prepare to meet your maker, 99. Yeah! It's freak cool! <laughs> and flutter. Hook shot! Alright, long shot! And then go like this one! Yay! Uh, 99, correct? 99 red balloons go by? Yes, it did. Alright, now. Yep, yep, yep. No. Okay, so looks like we do know where the last sculpture is. Thank the Lord. It's not gonna be too hard to find. Uh, I guess I'll end it off here. I kind of want to teleport to the Temple of Time, but there's actually a cutscene there. As you know, the Sage told us to go to the Temple of Time, so I'm kind of scared to teleport there. So you know what? I think I'll do that at the beginning of the next episode. Should I risk it? <sighs> I do like living life on the edge. Let's do it. If it does start a cutscene, I'll have to cut the episode off there. So, if it does start a cutscene, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe already. My name's Chris, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye maybe! Up, right, up. Together, up. Up, right, up. Together, up. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, concentration. Constipation, constipation, now bacon. Alright, let's go and hope for the best. Please don't teleport me right into a cutscene.